Assalamualaikum friends, my name is Adnan Kurban and uh, in this video tutorial I will teach you how to send data from uh, one form to another form using sessions. Uh, so let's uh, begin uh, by creating a new project. Just click on file, new and uh, select project uh, from the list of uh, these templates. Uh, just select web and uh, click on the ASP.web application. Change the name if you want to. I'll keep it as it is and click on OK button. Again OK. Okay, go to uh, your solution explorer and uh, right click on your project and uh, just add two web forms on it. Uh, it. Web form one and uh, let's add another web form. Just right click on your project and just select add and click on web form and it will add another form for us. Okay, now go to web form one, mm, go to design, add to controls uh, is text box and a button as well button okay uh, go to the properties of this button and uh, change the text uh, from button to send and uh, this is the ID of this button uh, we'll keep it as uh, send btn okay and just go to its uh, events and uh, create an on click event for this button and uh, go to web form 2 go to its design section and add a label on it and uh, go to the properties of that label and change the text property of that label to just blank keep it empty okay, save it now go back to your web form 1 and uh, inside its on click event create a session by typing session and uh, then mentioning the name of that session let it be as uh, s1 and uh, then uh, we have to provide value that we want to store in it and uh, since we are taking that value from the text box 1 this is text box 1 so we will keep uh, type here text box 1 dot text okay so this will uh, this is how we can create a session and assign some value to it now we will type response dot redirect to uh, redirect from one form to another form and since we want to go back uh, to go to web form 2 so just type web form 2 dot aspx so it will take us to web form 2 uh, and uh, go to web form 2 and uh, we want to let's say if we want to display the value into that label that we will enter into this text box then what we have to do is uh, we have to go to the code of this web form uh, 2 and uh, inside its page load event we will change the text property of that label 1 into the our sessions value so just type label 1 dot text and type session and uh, mention the name of the session from where we want to get the value since we are uh, going to get the value from s1 session just type session and its name and type dot to string since the label is of t a string type uh, so this is how you can simply create a session and uh, redirect yourself from one form to web form 2 and uh, web form 2 okay and uh, on the page load event of web form 2 we have a label l1 and label 1 and uh, we have retrieve the value of this session s1 into this label so let's run our project and see if it works just go press ctrl f5 or click on this uh, button ok uh, now type some value into, the, into this text box let's hit developer and uh, click on this button and uh, it will take us to web form 2 and put that uh, value into this label uh, we can ok again click on the button uh, you can see that this is web form 1 and click on this send button and uh, this is web form 2 and here is our value that we have used to send from web form 1 to web form 2 so this is how we can uh, use sessions uh, to send val a single value from one form to another another form 